Thank okay, you so we're watching the direct. I this can't wait to see what this is. This will be presentation of Super Smash Brothers for Nintendo 3DS and Wii U. I hope you'll enjoy this finale. I'm just sad it's the last one. The so, main character from Corn. Fire Emblem We have Corn, and I don't. Okay. Joining the fight. I didn't even know who this was. I didn't know that Corn was actually. As we developed new fighters, we thought to include someone from this Emblem. upcoming game. That's how we decided to begin production on Corn. That's. I mean, that's cool. It's they look cool. Since the new Fire Emblem title launched in Japan, but we're now just a couple months away from launching it in the rest of the world, so you'll get a chance to become familiar with Corin before you play the game. As with Wii Fit Trainer and Robin, you can choose to play as a male or female version of Corin. Oh, okay, Both perform that's cool. Exactly the same, so it's all up to that's personal That's really cool. Problems. You may notice the sword in Corin's hand. It's the final form of the weapon Yato, called Omega Yato. However, that is not his primary way of fighting. That's really cool. Corin has the blood of a dragon in his veins, and this lets him transform. This ability allows him to pull off attacks that no other fighter can. He's capable of changing entirely into a dragon, but some of his moves transform only some parts of his body. Okay. His side smash attack has tremendous reach. The tip of this attack is especially powerful. Okay, so it's so another tip character like Mars. From your opponent when you use it. That's really cool. When using back air attacks, Corin briefly sprouts wings. He moves forward when his wings appear, which may just give you the extra boost you need when recovering. After activating a dragon attack, his head changes in appearance. That's really cool. Corin's standard special can be charged up by pressing and holding the B button, the Dragon Fang Shot. If you land it, your opponent will be paralyzed for a bit. After firing, the transformed hand can also bite a nearby opponent. This follow-up attack so cool. can also be charged by holding the B button. This combo deals a lot of damage and can really launch a foe. Corin's side special is a jump followed by a low thrust to the okay. side, the Dragon Lunge. But this is not just a simple thrust. Depending on damage ratios, the I see that you can this character could actually be really good and really you technical even as well. Your foe in place with this move. It just depends on how fast execution After for the attacks are and how much damage a front kick, e slash she does. Kick, jump um, or cancel. Pin your opponent but and decide what to do based that's really on the situation. Cool. I also love that they talk about canceling in the direct. The up special puts Corin's wings to work. Dragon Ascent. At full wingspan, Corin has a wide attack range. Oh, uh, okay. You I don't really like specials that do damage as well, too. like for the recovery. Wisely. Because a lot of people try to use them to kill, and I don't think surge. that recovery attack should it's be used to kill, but familiar to fans of the Fire Emblem Fighters. Still really awesome. One big difference is a visual one. The dragon transformation. Look carefully, and you can see that the opponent's attack doesn't reach you. Other differences include being able to launch opponents upward and attack left and right equally. That's really cool. Corin's final smash is torrential roar. I like that the counter is not just another boring little flash. opponents with a whirl of water and then finish them off all at so, once. So this character might actually be my favorite Fire Emblem character in Smash, depending on. Damage, execution. No exclusive stage for this new fighter. What about new music then, you say? But that's yes, really cool. No exclusive Corrin stage. Version, yeah, but there you guys you have it. Corrin is in Smash, and honestly, I'm pretty happy about it. I don't really know the character the too well, but they look the really awesome. Theme song. Lost in Can't the wait to see what the next one is. It includes vocals.